Hello there, all you beautiful thrill seekers. My name is Ghost Shadow Stubborn, but built for theme parks, and welcome to Ghost Chat YouTube channel. <laughs> Hello there, guys. My name is Ghost Shadow. Welcome to another theme park newsroom update. Now, this is coming from Six Flags Kadia. This is a brand new theme park project coming to Saudi Arabia and we now have some official details from the group about the Falcon's Flight roller coaster, confirming Intamin's involvement in the project. Now, I think we all had the same reaction when this was first announced. This is surely not going to happen. This is really not going to happen. However, this could still have a chance of happening with more details being revealed about the coaster. Now, we're going to share you all the details from the roller coaster in this video, so stay tuned. Uh, but before we do any of that, make sure you like the video if you've loved it. Make sure you comment down below your thoughts and opinions. I'd love to get your thoughts and opinions down in the comments down below and reply to every single comment as I usually do. You know I do. Let's get some more comments in. I love it. I just love reading all your comments. And then also, guys, in the description down below, as well as checking out the link where you can find the article uh, that supports all this information and shows off the information in this video, you can also find links to where you can submit your video ideas. Use the Google Forms link, linked in the description. You can also find links to Twitter, TikTok, Instagram, and Snapchat for the channel. And also, guys, you can check out the Discord server link. Click on there, get into the Discord server, and be part of the Theme Park Magic. And for now, guys, let's have a look at all the information surrounding Falcon's Flight coming to Six Flags Kadir, the brand new Saudi Arabian theme park. So this is from the official Kadir press conference, and it officially states as follows. Q QIC, Kadir Investment Company, in partnership with Intamin Amusement Rides, has kicked off the design process for the Falcon's Flight, the signature attraction of Six Flags Kadir, a one-of-a-kind theme park scheduled for opening Kadir's first phase. The Falcon Flight is set to become the world's longest, fastest, and dullest coaster. It will travel across approximately four kilometers, feature a vertical cliff dive maneuver into a 160 meter deep valley using magnetic motor acceleration, LSM technology in brackets, and achieve unprecedented speeds of 250 plus kilometers an hour, which is a hell of a lot faster than usual coasters. <laughs> Falcon's Flight will also be the world's tallest freestanding coaster structure, featuring a parabolic airtime hill, allowing a weightlessness airtime experience. Kadir's Chief Executive Officer, Philippe Gass, commented on the signature ride, saying, Roller coaster fans around the world have been eagerly anticipating this ride since it was announced, as there's nothing quite like it anywhere else. Now we're in the design stage with the experts at Intamin and the engineering team at Six Flags. The excitement is building. Falcon's flight will dominate the skyline at Kadir and weave all the way around our destination, right out the theme park, up the cliff side and down the cliff face. The greatest drop of any ride in the world, it won't be for the faint hearted. On each ride, a three minute long adventure, up to 20 passengers will experience the exhilaration of three electromagnetic propulsion launch systems as well as panoramic views of Six Flags Kadir and the resort core. Daniel Scopen, Vice President Design and Development at Intamin, commented, I will never forget the moment when I was standing at the edge of the 200 meter high cliff on the Tokoya Mountain in Kadir, looking into the valley and imagining the creation of a future record setting roller coaster. I knew exactly at this spot the Falcon Flight will dive down along the cliff, ending in a unique exhilaration to exhilarating 250 plus kilometers an hour proximity flight close to the ground. The worldwide unique setting and height such as the natural cliff will enable us to design an architectural masterpiece in steel. Covering 32 hectares and featuring 28 rising attractions across six themed lands, Six Flags Kadir is set to become the theme park that breaks all records of entertainment in Saudi Arabia and the region. So there we go, ladies and gentlemen, thrill seekers of all ages. That is the press conference from both Kadir's statement and Intamin's statement included in, as well as some information around the ride. A three minute long experience, over 250 kilometers an hour max speeds, a um, 160 foot cliff dive uh, maneuver. It's just going to be brilliant. Intamin designing with it. Uh, Six Flags Kadir working with Intamin to design the coaster now. And, you know, to hear this news, it makes it even more believable. Now, I think the same... Like I said before, I think the same reaction 
was from all of us when this first was announced. No way in hell is this going to be built. No chance in hell, as Vince McMahon would say. We all turned into Mr. McMahon. No chance in hell this is going to happen. Um, but <laughs> it's Sunday, and you know what that means. Uh, we get this massive news update. Now, obviously... Um, Falcon's flight looks amazing from the concept images, from the concept video as well. We saw the concept video for it. Um, the trains of the ride, when we saw that original concept video, it did look very much like the Velocicoaster trains at Jurassic at the Jurassic World coaster at Islands of Adventure and Universal uh, that's opening this year. It kind of looked like um, Velocicoaster type trains a little bit. It gave me vibes of that when comparing both of them now. Um, and, you know, seeing the design process of Falcon's Flight, or hearing about the design process, it's definitely going to be interesting, and I can't wait for this to potentially open. Um, I think it's like, what, 2023, 2024, this part, this part, this whole part is scheduled to open? So I won't think that, I mean, they're designing it at the minute, so it's going to take most of 2021 probably to design this. But 2022, I mean, if they're going to take a year or two to construct this, like a year and a half minimum. So, it's going to be about halfway through this year that we'll probably see some construction start on the actual coaster, as well as other teams working on the rest of the park. So, it's going to be interesting to see how this develops and, you know, how the construction goes. I'd love to get the Kadir group uh, on the channel, actually. I'd love to get the Kadir group on the channel to talk about the coaster and talk about the Six Flags Kadir, talk about the rest of the park. It'd be nice to get that interview uh, because I'm quite, I'm, well, not quite interested. I'm very interested to see how they're going to do this project. Um, I'm sure you guys are really excited as well. I mean, there's a lot of things we saw on the concept arts for Six Flags Kadir. Uh, the Tilt Coaster, the RMC, the massive Frisbee ride. Um, you know, there's loads of other coasters as well. So we knew we knew that something big was coming with this. And when we saw Falcon's flight, we knew it was going to be massive. We knew it was going to be colossal. Not to you know play, play a pun on Colossus at Six Flags Magic Mountain, um, but it was a colossal investment when we saw the concept images. When we saw the official teaser trailer video from the Kadir Group. Um, but Falcon's flight, hearing about the design of it, hearing the stats of this ride. It's getting me super excited now. Really, really is. And, you know, by 2023, 2024, COVID will be a thing of the past. We're looking forward this year and beyond. Um, so it'd be nice to get out there to Kadir and experience this new attraction when it opens. Um, and I'm sure you guys will want me there at the opening as well. And I'll be able to do like a vlog, you know, travel vlog, travel to Kadir, back from Kadir, that kind of thing. And, you know, it'd be very interesting to experience it on opening day because I'm sure this would be a wonderful roller coaster. And to experience the world's tallest, fastest, uh, longest coaster, I mean, that's going to be an incredible experience. Obviously, the tallest one at the minute is King Dakar. Fastest one's that Montana Rusa at Ferrari World in Abu Dhabi. Uh, the longest one is still still Dragon 2000 um, at Nagashima Sparland. So, you know, they're breaking records, including their own record from King Dakar at Six Flags Great Adventure. Um, so it's very, very exciting to sort of see all the process of that. But anyway, thank you very, very much for watching this very exciting update on Six Flags Kadia on their brand new Falcons Flight Rally Coaster. Uh, I am pre-recording a lot of Coast Child reviews, uh, just so there's some videos out if there's any times where I can't film a video. Uh, but uh, there will be some pre-records um, that are being filmed at the minute, so uh, still a lot of videos to come, a lot of reviews. Kong River Rapids being reviewed, Squirrel Nutty's going to get reviewed, Riverbank Ice Spy, The Sky Ride, loads of Alton Towers reviews. I'm going to look at other parks as well, look at other attractions that I could review as well from other different theme parks in the UK, uh, so those reviews will get pre-recorded as well. Um, we're also going to have some other discussion videos. I love doing discussion videos, so I might do some more uh, prediction videos. I did get a new video suggestion, so I will be looking at that as well, uh, as well as your other current video suggestions. If you've got a video idea, send it in the Google Forms link. It's in the description down below. But for now, guys, thank you very, very much for watching this theme park news update. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And for now, guys, my name is Coach Chow, Caitlin on the Coast Life, and I'll see you guys next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a Kadia-tastic day.